Welcome to part number 23 of Gran Turismo 1. This is the Movie Chicane, and today, for the second attempt in a row, we're gonna try the American, or the US Japan Sports Car Championship. I think that's how it's called. But anyways. In my first attempt, I used this Camaro Z28 30th anniversary, but this car, it's gotta go. It's a hunk of, it's a, it's a piece of junk. Sorry, buddy. You have to go. So instead, what we're gonna do is... No, it's not what I'm gonna do. What we're gonna do instead is... Use the Nismo 400R. Because there's this one Impreza rally car. This one in particular. That's been causing us a lot of problems. So we're gonna have to get close to his... Power to weight ratio. We're probably not gonna get anywhere near, but as long as we have all-wheel drive, I think we'll be fine. Okay, stage one turbo kit should be enough. So let's mod everything else but the power. This is actually the first time I've ever lost a championship in this game. This is literally the first time that I've had actually had to repeat a championship. And if you guys ask, it's not a really good feeling. <laughs> Now the racing mod. It's getting any yellow. So how much does the car weigh now? Okay, I think we'll have a shot this time. So once again, let's go ahead and do the US Japan Sports Car Championship and away we go. Round number one, Trial Mountain 2 and... It's almost the same field as last time. So last time we had the same exact field, except the Viper GTS was actually the Viper RT10, and the GTO was actually the Lancer. So, round number one, like I said, Trial Mountain 2, and unlike the Camaro, this car should have a good launch. Yep. We're gonna have to go all out here to fight the, the Impreza. That Viper GTS is actually keeping up with Impreza. That car is probably gonna be really tough to fight as well. Oh yeah, this thing is a beast. I mean, yeah, we could have probably gotten the Stage 2 Turbo, but I didn't want to be completely OP, because I know this car could probably do like 900 horsepower, or 800 at least. But, nah. It's fun to keep it kind of low. Plus, it's a Nismo 400R, so it already has some parts in it. Lopping all over the place like a fish. I expect the Viper and the Corvette to come alive, probably around the second round. I mean, that's what they did, right? From, yeah, yeah. It was the second round with Special Stage Route 5, so the Corvette was pretty much unstoppable at that track. Well, we managed to win, but he was pretty good there.
damn, we're actually pulling away from the Impreza. This card's actually kind of OP. I have to remove the turbo kit. I'm considering removing the turbo, even though it's just stage one. I mean, if this car is this OP, then yeah, we might just have to. But, um, yeah, actually, no. We're not that far ahead. I mean, we're leading this little train, I guess. This pretty spread out train, but yeah, I mean, like, the Impreza is not that bad. I said Impreza, the 400R is not that bad. And with these funky juicy one faces, I I just don't trust the game sometimes. I have to like really slam on the brakes when the car starts hopping around. There we go, we win. The Viper finishes last. Ow. Alright. So there we go. We win round number one. I'm going to save this replay. And on to the second round. Alright, round number two. Special stage route five. Climbing through the gears into turn number one, we go. And Impress is all, already far ahead. Oh, three wide. <laughs> Why the car went into idle? The hairpin. What the hell? Am I hitting the circle button by accident? I probably am. I just tap it twice. Nice pass on the outside to get the speed bars. I didn't even hit circle that time. Maybe it's just this car that does that. That Corvette's gonna give us a lot of trouble here on the straightaway. Final lap.
Yeah, once again, I didn't even hit circle. Okay, well we win once again. Surprise, surprise. Leading by over eight points. And onto round number three. All right, round number three, high speed ring. Now, I'm not sure what to expect from this race. Maybe the GTO could be a surprise winner. Who knows? Or not a surprise winner, but you know, a surprise podium, maybe. Finally hitting the red limiter. Now we're going through white into one. Oh snap! The Corvette is just coming. A full head of steam. And Perez is trying to get back at us. Oh my God! This is intense. Emerge victorious here. There we go. Now he's going to fall back. Viper up to second. The Viper can stay there, and that'll take even more points away from the Corvette and the Corvette. I mean, as exciting as I want the championship to be, we've lost the championship while leading two points in the finale with the Camaro. So, I just want to close the championship early. Come on, Viper, you can get up there. Third win of, of the championship, and let's see what the points are like now. Wow, 11 point lead heading into the fourth round. That's a pretty big gap. Let me save this replay, and on to round number four. Grand Valley East 2. The Impreza was alright here last time. Well, except for the straightaway. Already up to the lead.
damn, we're pretty much untouchable in this race. Well, this car is pretty OP. Which at this point, I don't really care. I mean, like I said, I, I lost the championship in the final round with the point lead. And then Impreza was just nowhere to be found. Route 11, I mean, that Impreza was just so well set up for that track. Except for the straight, obviously. But I think by the time it started hitting the red limit on the straight, people were barely coming out of the straight, or coming out of the final corner. So it really didn't matter, honestly. Triangle Max in it. Final lap. Oh, they're really aggressive. Set of corners. And there we go. So we go from leading the championship and losing it at the very end to clinching the championship with a round to go. There is no way I'm losing the championship. We, we pretty much doubled our lead. We're leading by 18 points. That's how bad of a race the Corvette and the other guys had. And with a lack of consistency for the other guys and pretty much winning all four of the rounds so far, we we won the championship with a round to go. So special stage round 11, like I mentioned before, is the final round of the championship. But pretty much it's not even a round for us, it's literally just a victory tour. And a bit of a fun race now. No pressure, nothing. We're pretty much good. That's why I like all the accelerator, it's just all the cars bump into me, oh my god. Everyone's just bunched together at this game. Impreza just hit the wall and almost took us out, but like it even matters, honestly. We already won the title. There's literally no need to complain about anything right now or be too worried. Unfortunately, you can't exit the race because if you exit the race, you forfeit the championship. They didn't start implementing skipping races until Gran Turismo 3.
Well, why am I taking a nice easy? I should just push. I mean, like I said, we already won the title. I said that like five times, I think, but... I mean, I, I have to just keep reminding myself, we already won the championship. We're not in a situation like we were with the Camaro in the previous attempt. Alright, here we go. Final lap. Like, there's literally nothing else for me to say, really. I mean... This is pretty much over. As long as we just... Keep it clean and... Don't mess anything up, we're really much home free. That won't stop bouncing. to the final corner, we sweep this entire championship. All five races, five wins. No one could stop us. And we win the championship by 21 points. So pretty much two race victories and I think like a fourth place finish. And let's go ahead and continue. So for winning the championship, 20,000 credits, championship trophy, and a brand new car. All right, what do we win for our efforts? <gasps> no way! Sweet! The Viper GTS-R? Oh man, I freaking love this car. Okay, I know I said, I think after the GT Cup, that we're gonna for sure use the Toyota Chaser LM Edition. Where are you, right here? But, I lied, I'm sorry. There is a guarantee, it's guaranteed we're using this car in the championship, or in, in the game. Whether it's the finale, whether it's the Grand Valley race, or the Special Stage Round 11 race. We're using this car for one of those events. Period. Oh my god, I'm so happy I won this thing. <laughs> so awesome. Alright. Well, that takes care of the first of the Three Nations Cups. Coming up next will be the second of the Three Nations Cups.